Yeah, what's going on then, guys? So, two videos in a row, that's a bit weird. But, um, the deck that I've been laddering with in singles on Dueling Book is actually Pure Striker. Um, and to be honest, I prefer this build over Trickstar. Trickstar applies a lot of pressure, but the thing about, like, the actual Pure deck is the fact that you gain so much card advantage off of so little that... You usually would stand every other matchup. The only matchup I don't particularly like is the FTK, but you'll see that I'm playing certain cards to stop the FTK. Um, like, as a whole, I think the deck is correct to play right now over Trickstar, but my opinion may change in a few weeks' time. We never know. Um, and then run up to YCS Milan. This is probably what I'm thinking about playing. Um, and I may actually be going to YCS Milan, which is a bit strange, um, as long as I can get my passport sorted. Um, but I'm going to get right into the video and just explain my card choices and why I'm playing certain things and stuff. So let's just get right into it. Uh, we're playing the obligatory three copies of Ray. Um, I don't think two's correct. I noticed that a lot of people are playing two. I think you have to play three and you have to play reinforcements to the army, which I do play as well. Um, this card's so important in actually getting your head, which is what you want to do in the Trickstar matchup. Um, oh, sorry, in the Sky Striker, like Mirror, is just getting ahead as quickly as possible and getting three spells in grave as quickly as possible to resolve the broken effects of your cards. Um, but three ray is really standard. Um, three draw and luck. Uh, we all know what this card does. This is purely for the FTK. Like, I played it in Trickstar for other reasons, we all know why. But um, this card, and this card, once again, and the obligatory driver, um, they all help against the FTK. This deck beats every other deck except for the FTK. Um, I'm playing all the cards in the main to beat the old Skies matchup, which is the other quote-unquote bad matchup. Um, but like, like even playing these two as well. So, against Altergeist, you have this, you have Twin Twister, and you have Heavy Storm Duster, which I'm also playing. They completely blow out that deck. And you have like, Evenly's in the side as well. Um... I don't think I'd actually play Ash Blossom in the main at the moment, I don't think it hits enough, but we obviously have to play cards for Colossus, so things like Mind Control or other cards I'm considering. Um, like I'm playing the Foolish Kids engine because that allows us to get more spells and grave to make your Widow Anchor better. Um, and we're going to sideboarding later on in the week, um, after I've had some more experience against Thunder Dragons. Um, obviously I've played against them a lot online, but in real life it's slightly different. But yeah, so there's, that's it for the monsters, we're playing 3, 6, 10, 12 monsters in total. A lot higher than normal uh, Sky Striker, but we need to beat the FTK, so yeah. Uh, triple Engage, Triple Field Spell, Triple Multi Roll, uh, this is 100% correct. Um, and then the 2 Widow Anchor. So, my reasoning behind 2 Widow Anchor is this card only does stuff going like going into sort of the late game. Like I don't like to utilize this turn one. Um uh, sure I'll search one because it's a very good card. But I think I've only resolved or wanted the third window anchor like twice in testing. So who knows, maybe I'll play the third at some point, but right now I'm enjoying two. Um triple roll and triple field spell. Um so the deck that won YCS London was doing this and I was like, oh shit, because the thing is you want to draw multi roll. You don't want to search it. I think having your opponent under your multi roll is way more important now than ever. I think if you add, if you have this turn one and engage, you should probably win that game. Um, and also it puts more spells in growth because you have to beat this, kill a spell, add it with this, kill this, get ray. Um, and then if you resolve engage that turn, that means you're drawing, which I think is pretty ridiculous. Um... I don't need to explain engage, do I? Like, engage is engage. It's a really strong Yu Gi Oh card. Nothing much to say there. Um, Eagle Booster. I absolutely hate this card. But you have to play it for the mirror, so. Uh, one Jamming Leaves. Uh, actually, kind of good against um, the T Dragon deck. And also, just other. Well, this is an 8th card against all guys, I guess. Uh, Hercules base, only playing this because I can't resource manage properly. Um, as I get better and better with the deck, this will come out, but for now, we're still playing it. Uh, the one Hornet Drains, uh, Afterburners, and Shotgun. I'm thinking about playing two of this. Um, I'll go into reasoning 
Five men who do play it, but for now we're still playing the singular one. Uh, two gets one metal face fusion. Nothing to explain here. Um, thinking about playing the second metal face fusion. Um, Cody Angelov's list played to. Uh, oh, where was it? it was the two hundred with YTS, and he played two of this. And I think his theory is correct. Like, even drawing this isn't bad, especially considering I'm playing three multi roll and three field spell. I think it is plausible to play this at more than one. Uh, double desires, uh, blowout cards, good cards, spells and grave, rotor, upstart, two more cards to blow out, blow out the, uh, the, the quote unquote buy. <laughs> um, and then on to the extra. Uh, Three red, three blue, two green, Cerberus, Phoenix, Ningirsu, Omega, Saiyuja, Firewall, Borrowed. I don't own a Borrowed Sword, that's the only reason I'm not playing it. And then, Tokens. Uh, this is the only token I ever use. But, yeah, that's going to be it for the video, guys. I'm really enjoying this deck over Sky Strike, uh, over Trickstar. Um, not saying that Trickstar is in any way worse, because it's obviously not, but I just prefer playing Pure. I think Pure Strike is one of the best decks, if not the best deck right now, other than the FTK. And as long as you prepare for the FTK with hand traps, you should be fine. Um, I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit the like button. I really do appreciate it. Um, every like makes me want to carry on doing this stuff. I hope you have an amazing day. See ya.